Hello everyone, this is Shruti. I am going to take a concept on shear force diagram and bending moment diagram. First we will see what do you mean by shear force. Shear force is nothing but algebraic sum of all forces that present in this section either to the left or right side of the section. For that what do you mean by then algebraic sum? Algebraic sum is nothing but we have to consider these forces along with the sign. Okay. So for that case first we will see what is the sign convention that, that we have to consider to calculate shear force. So first what is the sign convention? Um, I am going to take always from the left to right. We can take both ways from here. You can calculate the force from left to right or right to left. I will consider from shear force from left to right. In that case, left to right, the case, the upward will be positive and downward will be negative. Okay, consider only one uh, reference side that is from left to right or right to left. If you are considering from left to right, consider always upward force as positive and downward force as negative. Okay, to avoid confusion, consider only one thing. Then according to this sign convention, uh, we will see what is the shear force value that is your upward is positive, your section is here. So it will be P plus Q minus R. Okay, this will be a shear force value and for the uh, shear force value your unit will be kilonewton or newton according to the force that is present in the problem. Then next we will see what do you mean by bending moment. So bending moment First of all, what is moment? Moment is nothing but force into a perpendicular distance. Suppose this is a force and suppose this is a distance D. So P into D is nothing but your moment. Then what do you mean by bending moment? Bending moment is nothing but algebraic sum of all moment which causes that moment which caused by the force either to the left or right side of the section. That means you have to consider again the moment along with the sign. Okay. So for that case the sign convention will be there. Uh, for point load UDL and UVL such cases we can consider the this sign convention that is bending moment for that case it will be upward always positive and downward always negative. That for the case point load UDL and UVL. Okay. When the couple like moment or this moment uh, when couple is considered in the bending moment or in the problem then what is the sign convention we will see that. So for that case we have two types of bending moment hogging bending moment and sagging bending moment. So first we will see what do you mean by hogging bending moment. Hogging bending moment is nothing that the moment or that couple it tends to bend the beam in the upward direction or your tension will be at the topmost fiber that is nothing but your hogging bending moment. So see here just don't consider the uh, that is clockwise or anti-clockwise uh, couple because for this case if you consider before from the left to right or right to left it will get confused. So for that case just see how the beam bends whether it beams bends upwards or beam bends downward. Suppose if you are couple tends to bend the beam upward then consider the sign negative okay if the beam bends upward then consider the sign negative it might be either to the left or right side of the section so next case is a sagging bending moment and unit for the bending moment is kilo newton meter or newton meter So for this case your beam beam bends downward or your tension will be at the bottom most fiber 
and the sign convention is for sagging bending moment it is always positive so remember this if beam bends upwards consider negative bending moment and if beam bends downward consider the positive bending moment okay that's all next we'll uh, in the next uh, uh, point we'll see how to solve the sfd and bmd problems so if you want to continue my the uh, teaching you can subscribe my channel thank you